Good morning, Steve Mann from the IMDT, Nancy from the block. <laughs> What's that, Grandad? Uh, okay, I just wanted to take two minutes just to talk about <laughs> anti anti dog training. I'm a dog trainer by trade. You know, my job is to to get dogs to teach dogs to do stuff, or to teach dogs not to do this but to do that instead. Um, but I think there's a lot of value in just spending time and just being with the dog, not having an agenda. Time is short for everybody, me, you, everybody. Time is short. I mean, no dog needs mental and physical stimulation. It tends to be a, a standard answer uh, to a lot of questions. But when time is precious, I think sometimes we can fall into a trap of trying to cram as much physical and mental stimulation in as possible in the window of time that we have and dogs learn that it's feast or famine now a lot of dogs a walk is kick down the front door and go 100 mile an hour and get as much information as possible sight sound smells textures because when they go back indoors again boom it stops you know and we get what we teach we get what we train so let's not have dogs uh, every single time they go out that they're looking to uh, gorge they're, that they're acting with a lot of too much urgency it's unhealthy and it's no fun because you tend to go one way and a dog tends to go another way and gorge on that information it's like being at a restaurant yo sushi and the conveyor belt's just going too fast so you're having to grab what you can and you're not going to engage in a conversation and you're not going to invest in the person that you're with because you're just too concentrated on grabbing and you're not going to enjoy the food either uh, so if you're into your dog sports and you're into your high octane stuff or you've got a dog that's maybe a little bit fizzy or you've got a lifestyle that's a little bit too fizzy just when you go out and about with your dog just spend time just sit on the floor you know a healthy dog park to me isn't 50 people throwing tennis balls and 50 dogs going bow, 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 bow. it would be 50 people and dogs just sat on the floor just investing time spending time no rushing no urgency I, I think that would be very healthy every now and then to see so you know spend five minutes ten minutes one-on-one -on -one with your dog us mammals we like touching with permission <laughs> we like touching it releases some nice chemicals up there so invest in that in a little bit and just teach your dogs that not everything has to be um, grabbed at 100 mile an hour it's very healthy spend time to smell the roses or the dog we <laughs> decide who does what uh, okay Maharishi Steve Mann signing out uh, enjoy your dogs and as I always say to clients, slow down. I never say speed up unless they're writing checks. Just slow down. Um, get paid by the uh, get paid by the hour, not by the mileage. All right, have a good day. Love you. Ciao.